Yo, what's poppin'? It's your boy Ron Ricketts with this week's edition of Ricketts Review. Arsenal fans, calm down. Calm down. You have no divine right of winning the Premier League. No divine right. There's teams in and around you that are as good as you or on form better than you. I know on paper you're probably looking at Leicester, you're probably looking at your rival Spurs, and you're saying, how are these guys competing with us or how are they ahead of us? Well, listen, I've got to tell you something. Teams have stepped up. They've worked out how to play against each other in that league. So it's a much more closer league. And it's made more interesting spectacle for us fans. But listen, calm down. I see fans going berserk on Arsenal TV. My boy Robbie. Great interviews, by the way, Robbie. But listen, these fans going ballistic. Arsene Wenger has done a lot for the football club. He's got you know, in a healthy position. You always qualify for the Champions League. you got to be a bit grateful. The slack that you're giving Wenger, I don't think he deserves it. So listen, sort yourselves out, calm down, go back to the drawing board and support your team to the end of the season. I've my, I myself, I remember being at clubs where the fans start losing it after three games. And I'm like, as a player, they're probably sitting there and they're thinking, pardon me, what? They're probably thinking, F you lot. Do you know what I mean? They're human beings. They need your support. It's not easy out there. Do you know what I mean? I see my boy Nighty killing them as well. I see Nighty, I see you killing them, Nighty. Calm it down, Nighty, bro. They need you. I see you lot killing them. Nighty did say, he did put up a list of players that he thinks should get um, cut at the end of the season or released. And I agree with some of them. Um, I won't say which names right now, but I do agree with some of them. And Yeah, man, you, you Arsenal fans, I think you lot think you got this divine right to go on and win the league. You are a big club, but, you know... On, on paper, you're not as big, I think, as people make out. Or on the pitch, I mean, teams have, find ways, have found ways to even things out. So, I mean, Spurs played against you. Spurs, who you lot probably think of the smaller club in North London, played against you and dominated you for possession. Dominated Arsenal. People never thought they would have heard that in the recent years. Spurs dominating Arsenal for possession and probably could have gone on to win the game. Amazing game, though. Amazing game. But anyway, Arsenal fans, take my advice. The players... Need you. The manager needs you. You don't need because what's happening is, um, because now we have social media, you lot's instant reaction is going out, and the, the media, who some of them not very educated, some some of them, and they're going out there and they're just putting out, they're putting out what they feel is a general consensus of the Arsenal Arsenal fan base. But then this is getting filled back to Wenger and press conferences. So you got to leave the man and make him feel support, make him feel harmony. I mean, you wouldn't keep supporting them to the end. All right? All right. It's your boy Rowan Ricketts. This week's a different of Ricketts Review. Ciao!